Good morning, everybody. It is a rainy old uh, Wednesday, no, Thursday day, Thursday day, Thursday today. It's about half seven, I think. And I am currently stripping my sleepy head. A lovely start to the day is just stripping down all the beds, putting on all the laundry. It's very glamorous. Toby is playing in the sitting room, which is like just right there, I can hear him. He is playing on his baby Bjorn bouncer, which also needs to be washed. I swear, like, all I do is wash laundry at the moment. It is crazy. <laughs> Our plan today is Rue's gonna go off to his nursery childminder and, I think I may have broken this. Uh, we, Richie and I might go to the garden center because we're gonna need some more flowers for our containers. So I'm gonna go and do that today, hopefully. So yeah, first up though, breakfast. two teeth right down here and he's just four months now he's just turned four months but he's teething two teeth and he is so cross all the time so he wants to be up here on me the feeding or just being held and cuddled which is fair enough it must be kind of horrible teething two teeth at the same time let's do an update actually with him i might do it today if i have time because uh yeah i feel like time's going by so quickly and Suddenly I have this like four month old baby, it's just crazy. Life is so mad with two little ones, for sure. The things that do get sacrificed are the house, so the house always looks disgusting. <laughs> and myself, I always look disgusting. Uh, to show you what's going on in the kitchen, so I'm sitting here eating my breakfast, Rue's down there, and then we have our lovely little um, celebration ring. The ring, it comes with another two pieces, so you can make it into a circle or different shapes. This is quite new for me. I've just bought it this autumn, but I love using it every morning and at meal times. It just is really therapeutic, especially on a rainy, disgusting day like today. All these lovely little characters that you can swap out. This is the little bumblebee, because we're talking about bees at the moment. There's a mushroom, so cute, a squirrel, a squirrel, and then there's the apple, because it's sort of apple season. But yeah, I'm really glad I got it. So yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna eat our breakfast. And yeah, crack on with the day. I've just changed him. He's got his little socks on. We've changed his bib. This jumper is so cute. By the way, I wanted to quickly show it to you. It's by a brand called Trotters, I think. That's where I got it from. And it's so cute. So yeah, we're ready to go. Ruth's just in the hallway reading, as usual. And we've got all our bags packed. I've got our bag. I'm just using my normal bag now as a baby bag. And then this is Ruth's school bag. And I've got my ergo, and I've also brought my rain cover because it's really disgusting outside. Change of clothes, wallet, phone, pretty good to go. We're just driving down the driveway, and we're going to bring this baby to school. And then we're going to go on the hunt for flowers. We've all had like stonking colds by the way, I don't know if you can hear like on my voice, we've been so sick and it's been horrible, especially like getting up every two to three hours with uh, Toby and dealing with the cold as well, oh like I wouldn't wish that on anyone, it's so challenging but we're through the worst of it now which is great and Toby seems to be okay, he had definitely had snuffles um, but that was 
was it. So <laughs> Rupert's just chatting away. Okay guys, I'm gonna go, I'm coming up to the road. So I'm gonna stop now and turn this off and I will see you in a bit. Um, some violets, pansies, <laughs> heather, um, and then some thyme and rosemary and these beautiful red, deep red flowers, so gorgeous. So it's time to go home now. I feel so much better from just being out and the flowers and everything, it's just so good. So we're gonna drive home and feed the baby, have a cup of tea and drive So off. we're back home. Toby's grumbling away, he's playing and desperate to sit up. Had a cup of tea, fed the baby and I'm about to go over and do our farm meeting about our supper club for September. So we're choosing the menu for that. So that's always good fun. Um, actually, I did get a book from the garden centre. So I'm going to show you that really quick. This is the book that I picked up. I couldn't resist it. It was so cheap. A uh, Riverford Farm cookbook. But what I liked about it was it was seasonal, which is quite useful for me and all the things that I do here on the farm. So really nice, actually. Really impressed. I'm gonna have a quick look at that and see if there's anything that can inspire October Supper Club. So we're just back in from our Supper Club meeting. Toby's all wrapped up in his um, Ergo Baby winter wrap, which is fantastic. Yeah, I'm really excited now for the Supper Club. It's gonna be so beautiful. We're gonna have like a big harvest feast and like loads of amazing things like plated loaves and like beautiful vegetables and an amazing stew and everything. So. I think it's going to be absolutely delicious. Toby's finally fallen asleep, so I just need to take him out of this and hope he stays asleep long enough for me to tidy the kitchen and make some lunch because it's almost one o'clock now and uh, I'm tired. Got a parcel to drop down to the post office and I need to go pick up a few bits as well from the shop and go to the library and then collect a roof. Hi guys, so we're back in the car again. I'm just at the library. I collected two books. I got, I'll show you quickly. I got the River Cottage Preserves book and I also got the RHS What Plant Where Encyclopedia which is really handy because we're planting a few um, sort of like uh, like a hedge, not hedge, like a ball boundary hedge I guess. Um, so we needed that to kind of like figure out some evergreens, it's a really really handy book to have at hand. Uh, Toby's fast asleep in the back which is great. We were also needing to post some stuff, I sold a pair of boots on eBay. But um, it was so jammed. It's kind of like three, three o'clock now. So um, I think schools are out. So it was just jammed in the post office area. So we jettisoned that one. I'll do that tomorrow, I think. And yeah, I'm just gonna go get Rue. Like, I'm so shattered now. <laughs> it's been such a busy day. And like every day at the moment is just so intense. Just kind of mumming it on my own, really. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go get my little Rupert. I've missed him so much. We didn't get any housework done apart from laundry, which is so annoying, but Toby was just so clingy. So all I could do was like hang on to him and I ordered, like put in a Sainsbury's order. Um, and what else did I do? I just had some lunch and that was it. Like the day has just gone by so quick. And um, we had our meeting, our farm meeting. So I guess like that is quite a lot in, in a few hours. So anyway, I'm gonna go get Rue and then that'll probably be it for today. I'll probably finish the vlog here and I will be back soon with another one and hopefully one that's a little bit more farm based I can show you the polytunnels and things like that as well which will be really fun 
So thanks so much for watching. Please make sure you subscribe, turn on your bell notifications, and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you soon in another video.